Evening all, and welcome back to Satisfactory, where we've had a few changes. Uh, you'll notice there's another new building there, but we'll get to that in a moment. Uh, I've moved our process of getting all the goods to here. Um, so we have the steel beams in the bottom, uh, concrete next, and steel bars at the top. Uh, that's just basically because I wanted to run everything that we're producing through the machines and then after the machines are processed or after the splitters the one that comes off the end comes down to here so it's the final run I haven't plugged in that last one yes I have yeah they're all plugged in there um, and I started building a steel factory here that we started the last episode um, I started building the machine here and I put in four machines inside and thought ah okay yep I get what I'm doing here and I need to do the same and my brain was going something isn't right because this should produce the same as what the other side is um, obviously the other side has the other machine has two but um it wasn't this this was not this factory here was not producing anywhere near the right amount and I was scratching my head trying to figure out why and what it was and it turns out that Basically, I had built this factory with Mark III belts in mind before I had access to Mark III belts or before I could really produce Mark III belts. So I didn't upgrade them. So uh, the input for the um, iron here was all Mark I belts. So it was just, it was, I mean, it needs 45 minutes. It was just dying. It was just completely dying on me and not being able to process stuff fast enough at all. Now we've got coal coming in, and I think I might need to do the same for the coal. I think there might be a problem with that. Yeah, I think coal's coming in. But I, I was thinking of moving this, this here, um, and then changing this floor into making steel beams as well. So we've got them doubled up, and then at the top it will do that, because upstairs we are just running out of steel beams. That's the major problem. Although, actually might not be true. See, this is making steel beams here, but I don't think it's making enough. Because I think the actual issue we're having here is... Uh, I don't know, concrete is steel beams. Um, <coughs> I manually fed a lot of these machines concrete because they were out of them. They had enough steel beams, like this one. It doesn't have enough concrete. So, the reason for that is that we're not making enough concrete. Uh, you can see here, we've got the inputs here. Concrete coming in and steel beam coming in. And then over here, after it's fed the machines, we've got one going out that way. Um, yeah, that one goes out up to there, and this top one goes out of there. So, basically, concrete comes in, and it goes that one, that one, and then one that way. So, that will get two by the time these get one. So that means that machine and that machine will get four of each type while these machines get two and these machines get one and then the fifth the sorry eighth and ninth concrete that comes through will go straight on so every nine that come in we get one that goes straight on otherwise it's filtered between the machines it's not very effective really i want better splitters i believe there are better splitters once you can configure but we need to research them and uh, I'm struggling for materials to reset things. But yeah, we are struggling for concrete. And the reason for that, that's a long way down. No, right. Uh, it's because this is already a Mark II running flat out. And it's not enough. It's just not enough to keep this coming. So we need to bring in some more concrete or limestone to run this machine, this, this whole system, much more effectively because my numbers aren't correct. Or I think they were correct because it was all based on that we didn't have belts at the time. So, yeah, so what I want to do is I want to bring in concrete. What did I do there? Something's not right there. Something's not right there. How is that going through the wall? How is that going through the wall? I, I, I'm as confused by that as you are. I 
think I had a splitter here originally, didn't I? I think that might have been the case. I think I might have had a splitter here. And uh, I've removed the splitter and then the belts just connect to each other. I think you yeah, maybe had a splitter down onto there. I don't even think this requires a Mark III belt. But I don't think we're producing enough for a Mark III belt. But I put one in because I think the rest of it is on Mark III. Anyway, but yeah, so, so these are using uh, 45 limestone and we're producing 120. So we're doing 45, 90, uh, 135 on each side. And that side's got an extra one. So we're doing 180 on either side. And we're only producing 120. So if I want to put another machine in here, which I probably kind of do, we're going to need more limestone. So let's go and find more limestone. Yeah. But I'll tell you what we'll do. We'll build a buggy. We'll build one of these. We'll go and do that. Let's let's build one of these. We can do it manually ourselves. Um, just because I want one, basically, because because I want one. That's why. Let's uh, let's go. Oh no. Uh, let's add that to the list. I want that. There we go. So let's just build all the things manually and build ourselves a buggy because I want to play with one of these. These look fun. This bench here. So, what do we need? We need heavy modular frames. There requires modular frames, loads of stuff, and screws. Well, we can make screws and we can make modular frames. So, let's make a couple of modular frames. Is it just five we need? No, we need five per one. Wow, okay. We need motors, which we still aren't making yet. I'm really, really lagging behind on actually making the things that. I should be making um I, I it's not that i keep getting distracted by stuff it's that i don't have the infrastructure in place to produce the things i want or need um in order to jump start ahead to making those like heavy modular frames on any de or motors or anything in a decent level I need way more input here and I've got the designs and ideas to do it I just haven't actually got around to doing it yet that's the problem just yank them there we go probably gonna need some more iron rods as well yank crystal oscillators I have no idea how you even make those no idea let's see here shall we uh Heavy modular frames. We can make three. Why can we make three? Because the steel pipes? I was building the steel pipes so that I could actually make other things, but. At least we've got some steel ingots. At least we've got some of those. That's, that's good. That's fine. Let's make you up. There we go. There's those. Crystal oscillators. Motors require stators. Stators we need four of. We need more than four of. We can build two motors. There we go. We had a motor somewhere else. Don't know what I did with it. Need more steel pipes. <coughs> um, yeah, crystal oscillators. I don't even have a clue where you make them. Consuming power charge. Ah, communications. So, crystal status requires quartz crystal and quartz crystal. Made there from quartz. Do we have any quartz? I thought we had some somewhere. Thirty six. Let's see whether that's enough. Also, the MAM should be finished and doing whatever it was doing if we left it doing something. Did we? we did. It was a hard drive. Okay, so what? We got alternate beacons that uses crystal slayers. We got alternate black pad and stitched iron plates. Aren't we already using a iron plate 
That gets rid of the need for screws. Oh, that's tempting. But I don't want to. We've already got one of those. So, uh, what's that? That's just requires two sulfur and one compacted coal. I really don't know which one to go for. My brain's just going that that's probably the better one to go for because it just requires wire, which is really easy to make. Wire is so much more easy to make. Um, we're currently using 10 and 24 to make three. We could be using six and 30 iron wire, not even, not even worry about it. That would, that would help. That would help. We'd have to redo our machines. Yeah, I'm going with that one. Well, don't know if that's that's a good idea or not, but we're going with that one. Okay. Um, and I don't have. Oh, I could do with making a well, ten crystal layers. Wow. Okay. I don't think we can do that. I'm not even convinced we can make enough. Here to build the crystal oscillator. Well, we can build one. How many do we need? We need five. We need more quartz crystals. Okay. So we're going to have to abandon that plan, I think. Um, yeah. Yeah, I think we'll abandon that and just deal with this here. Okay, so we've got quartz crystals. Got loads of iron on us. Could we get rid of that iron? I don't know where to put it though, which is the problem. Because everything's running so efficiently. Um, and it isn't using, well, say efficiently. Everything's running so inefficiently, it's not using anywhere near as much iron as required. So if I can find an alternate concrete pattern, that'd be great. Absolutely fantastic. Yeah, see everything here is like, no, we're fine for concrete. It's cold, we're having problems with it. Yeah, we're fine for iron. Okay, so we'll have to find some alternate place to put iron. Um, let me just put down a box. There we go. You take the iron, we don't want the iron. Uh, take the coal, we don't want that. The iron. You are those. You are those. We might grab some more of those before we. And then concrete. Put that in there. Okay, so, yeah, we're going to grab a couple of stacks of concrete. A couple of stacks of those because we might need those. And I probably want to grab another portable miner so that I can build a one of these. So that means I want to get rid of the explorer for the moment because that's that's confusing. Cable in case beams. Case beams are down here. Do, 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 do. Grab those. Why oh, had them on me? Aha! Right, cable. We need cable. Well, uh, yeah. No pull minor, please. There we go. Do. Bom. We don't have any more medical inhalers. Uh, Although I do have a way to research new metal inhalers. That could be useful at some point. But let's grab ourselves. What are you and why aren't you working? You are nothing. What were you going to be? Do we know? Any of you remember what this one was going to be? Because I've forgotten. I guess we'll figure it out later. Okay, so let's make ourselves some more cable, because we need cable. There we go, we can make that. We also need cable because we use cable everywhere anyway. And uh, what I want to do is I want to figure out how to have two inputs for my Limestone and uh, oh, that'll do. 
and uh, have it do two in one go. Does that still have any concrete in it? Yes, it does. Right. Okay. Must remember that. Yeah. So we've got one one line coming in here. Going in the centre of being split. What I'd really like to do is have either that line come in and feed one side, and the other line come in and feed the other side. I think that might be a better idea. If I remove that and uh, up, then we'll turn this off so I don't fill up my inventory with some stuff. And uh, put in a wall there. And then we want you, well, basically we want you to come to here, but that's going to look really dodgy. So what if we did that? Uh, nope. Production logistics, conveyor pole anywhere. You to there, and then you to there. There we go, okay. And then we want to go back inside, removing all this because it's not required. And that could probably just connect directly to there. Yes, we can. There we go. Okay, and then this one probably wants to go there, that makes sense. Just run it in the same place and uh, do that. Up, oh, damn it! Up, oh, you can do it. There we go. Put the ball back. There we go. All we need to do is get the cement coming over to here. Uh, limestone, sorry, not cement. I keep saying cement. Limestone. The term is limestone. It'll come from. It'll be the fourth one, I suppose, wouldn't it? So it'll come along and. Here and turn that way, I think. So let's build a pickable pole. Then we'll remove the pole. As and when required. Now I've got to do this running from that side this way, otherwise it breaks and all goes terribly, terribly wrong. Approaching another's clearance. Not sure what that means. Oh, is that? Uh, how many how many steps up is that actually? One, two, three, four, five. So one, two, three, four, five. Boom, there we go. Then you can remove these and they don't mind. It's awesome. Okay. There. One, two, three, five. You, you, there, and then you, there. Yeah, that's good enough for me. Then we remove these. And we have floating things in the air, but it's fine. It's fine. There we go. Right, so that's limestone coming in as well. Let's turn this limestone production back on. So that at least we're getting half the amount in we require. Oh, so 45, 80. I suppose I could put in another limestone machine, couldn't we? Uh, what are they? They are constructors. Be facing that away. 
me. You can go in there. So it comes down at the correct speed, it then must be split and split via fast belts, and then slow belts go into the machines. Right. Then you want to be set to concrete. Oh, we have silica, we have loads of stuff open that I've not even touched yet. I am so terrible at keeping up with things. Um, and then I suppose, oh, you can't connect, why can't you connect? that one. One, two, three. Why, why have I done that? Why? Yeah, I don't want to do that there. I want to do that there. And then you can connect to that one. There we go. Okay. And that will still power them all up. That'd be fine. These ones on this side aren't doing anything at the moment, so. Yeah. That is 120 coming in, and that's 180 required. So it's still slow, but it is better. And let's go hunting for lime, shall we? We know where some is. On our way, on our way along the system here. But because I put that in first, why is that? Why, why is that wrong? Why is that wrong? One, two, three, four, five. One, two, three. Ah, uh, one, two, three, four. It's on the fourth run. Right, remove. 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 This is kind of one of the reasons why I don't generally show me building things because I'll see a problem like that, that, that I could just leave, that could have been absolutely left, there'd be no issues with it at all, it works, still works just fine, but I don't like it. So I'll tear down loads of stuff, just to get it looking correct. Um, I'm making sure everything's lined up. You don't, you don't, <coughs> sorry, you don't need it to be. It will work absolutely fine when things aren't lined up and a little bit species. See that I don't mind so much because that's, that's a necessity, but, but um, yeah, it, it doesn't need to be lined up. It's just that when I see something like that, I'm like, no, that must be straight. Weird, it's like OCD, but only for games, because in real life, everything's a mess and I don't mind it being a mess. But in games, nope, it must be perfect, it must be perfect. Right. Okay. But now I'm starting from, because I've already put in a belt that faces that way, it's intelligent enough to know that the belt must face this way. So when I put it up here, you'll see the arrow is facing away from us, that way. So you just need to put in one belt and then you can you can go backwards and it works. Happy about it. There, come on. There we go. Don't know why I put it so high in the air. <laughs> it could have been at ground level, it would have still worked. My brain just kind of went, hey, get loads of clearance so that when you build things underneath them, you don't have to worry about it. And that is true. That doesn't mean the trucks and stuff can drive underneath it, even though these are replacing trucks. Okay, so <clears throat> where was the limestone? The limestone was here somewhere, was it? Was it here? Or was it further along? It might have been further along. If it was further along, that actually is going to cause us... No, it's not going to cause us a problem. No. Because of how I built this. It's fine. It's still going to work. So you go to there. Yeah. You go to there and then here's the limestone yes there we go it's almost like i knew what i was doing i'm gonna say almost because i don't i'm sort of making it up as i go 
which is fine, which is absolutely fine. So there we go. So you're now producing that there. What the hell happened there? Why did nobody tell me it did that? Why was nobody paying attention? Damn it. Then if I connect that to there, it's going to go, no, that's way too tall. You no, can't do that. Okay. Now, I don't want to put in a uh, one from there, cut straight down again, because that would cause all sorts of issues later if I wanted to run even more belts along here. So we'll do that. Oh. Something else as well. If, if you scroll the mouse wheel with nothing in your hand, it brings out your weapons, but then you can't scroll back to having nothing in your hand. You must have something in your hands. The only way I found to get around it is to put like a berry in there, a single berry, and eat it. And then you get empty hands. Which is, it'd be nice if you could unequip your weapon. There's probably a button for it, but I can't find it. So Anyway, uh, let's not get distracted. <laughs> That'd be a fine thing. Merger, merger, there. Merger wants to go, say, here. Now, about there. That looks good. Okay, we want a... Uh, uppy uppy thingy, um, conveyor lift, that's the word, like so, and then we want you to go to there, I thought that might be the problem, that's a little too close, little too close, uh, go there, uh, seven, 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 down here, boom, Yeah, that's fine. That's fine. And then we'll just replace that one there. Boom, there we go. Right, and then we want to grab our line. I suppose we'll grab that one and run it to here. And then you will start producing uh, line stuff for us. You're only producing oh, it's impure. Ah, oh, damn it. Damn it. Damn it, damn it, damn it. We need more. We need more limestone. Didn't realise that was an impure one. There is more limestone further along. Let's keep going. Let's keep going. This is basically the way I've been doing stuff. So I'm going to carry on going. Oh, the limestone's just there. I was going to say I'm going to. I should be back once I finish the limestone. But uh, I've run out of. Okay, so here's the limestone. Is this one impure? Yes, it is. Okay, so two of these together will be fine for it. So, um, I will go back to the base and pick up the bits and pieces that are required and uh, then I shall be back once we've put the limestone oh well yeah I'm gonna put the limestone in and then uh, we'll be back once that is running and then we'll get this steel plant up and working hopefully okay so there we go we have the uh, limestone coming in here it comes here uh, both of them were impure nodes, so it's only 120 between the two of them, so it's still not ideal for getting this whole thing working 100%. But, uh, well, it doesn't mean we've got 240 coming in rather than just 120, so we have doubled our limestone throughput. So this side's getting 120, that side's getting 120, and it requires 180, so 45, 135. Mm, really only feeding three of them but it's fine it's it's better it, it's better than it was let's put it that way now we're going to be producing a bit more concrete I think but these end machines are going to be still struggling quite a bit did I set this up correctly I did not there we go, you should be a fast one, you should be a fast one, you should be a slow one, there we go. And now the limestone can come through and actually run at high speed, awesome. And I think I picked up some limestone myself, I did, there's a hundred of it there. And there is 85 of it there, there we go, okie dokie. Right, so you can get going and you can get going then. All, the, all of it will grind to a halt very soon anyway because uh, our encased steel beams will fill up and then we're done. So, yeah. But okay. So. 
I've had a small change of heart. I don't want to finish the steel factory. Um, the steel factory is exactly the same as it was. It, 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 it's exactly the same as the other one. It's going to have four in it. And it's going to go up and then up again and up again and up again and up again. Uh, we're using one of the Mark II poles here, so we're getting all the machines from a single place. Uh, but it's going to go up and up and up. And we're going to have inputs along the back for coal and uh, iron. And just, just We'll just go up go up as far as we need to go. I could make it bigger. I think I may make it bigger because I can always move this over if I want to. So I might make it say too bigger. Might be awkward for that. Then mind you we can't go the other way as well because we've got stuff here so then maybe we'll go over and just move this to being somewhere else. But we'll figure it out, figure it out off camera. What I want to do instead is I would like to go and find some something new. Go we'll go on an adventure for the rest of the episode and we will go and find something new. Now I'm going to grab all the parts required. Make another Mark II uh miner. Which is just basically only two more of these. One and two. There we go. Bob. Awesome. And we're gonna put something in the mem. I don't know what we're gonna put in there. Can't we don't we purple pass lug? I think we have one of those, don't we? Somewhere. Sure we had a purple pass lug. Is it in here? Yeah there you are. Purple pass lug. Awesome. Right. Do, 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 do. I could do we get myself some more health as well. But we'll put the purple pass lug in here. Boom. 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 And leave that going. And uh, now I can build myself another Mark II miner. Oh, I need some more steel pipes. That's okay. We can make some here. We have the technology. What I want to do is I want to go hunting some uh, quartz crystal. I thought that would be something different to do. See if we can't set ourselves up something to do that. So I've got enough of the miner now. Uh, what about power? What about a biomass generator? Yeah, I can build a biomass generator. Awesome. And I can build myself a craft bench so I can make biomass. So yeah, let's go hunt one of them. I should do it in a truck, really, but I'm gonna do it on foot. He says no. No quartz? Really? Oh! What's there? What the hell was that? Four steel beams. Can't we do that one? Or wasn't that? I think that's what we did. Right, 1700 meters that way. We're going that way. After that very long trek, um, I 
we are here and it's poisonous. It's very poisonous here. Uh, I'm going to go around and go up over here. Good we can. Hello, buddy. Uh, we can. There is some copper just there, but... There we go. And ooh. ooh. Whoa. I don't like you. Die. 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 Okay, that was different. Right, and uh, yeah, so we have made it to the crystal. Uh, I don't think there's anything else here. We aren't terribly, terribly far away from the base. Oh God, there's poison up there as well. So much poison, so much poison. But we are far enough away from it to be awkward. Um, I mean, like, if we wanted to build directly to it, it we can't. I see we can't make something that's that long, although can kinda can. The base is there. Let's see, let's go into photo mode, isn't it? Zoom in. Zoom in. Do, 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 do. Zoom, 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 zoom. Yeah, there's there's the the extra belt. That's kind of where we want to bring it to. There. You can see the belt going along there. Um put a roof on that yeah so if we want to do that what I'd have to do is build a walkway from here all the way along to there kind of want to go in between those towers because I have a feeling there's going to be something on top of them yeah, I don't know what the draw says draw distance is for wreck there's a wreck there I can see it there it is so yeah, so the draw distance for wreck is really quite high, which is awesome. That does mean you can get up quite high somewhere and find wrecks, which is excellent. Getting to them, however, is a different matter because you need to find that. It even draws the creatures from as far away. Now that's quite impressive, actually. Yeah, so there's a couple of wrecks around, which is quite good. But if I want to build over there, what I've got to do, basically, is... Put in some foundation at whatever angle I want. So let's say we put it in that way, because I think that's going to be about right to get through that gap. Um, and then what I have to do is build walkways all the way along. And and you may be thinking, yeah, okay, I can put the walkways in there, but then I can't build on there. I can't build conveyor belts on them, because if you go to put your power poles down, uh, your constructor poles, you can't. You're right. You're absolutely right. You can't put them on there. But if you start a conveyor belt on solid ground, you can then put down the actual poles on the walkways. It will let you do it. It really lets you run run along and you can do that the bomb and then you can be pushed straight off the edge into your ultimate doom but it will let you do that that is completely valid you can then put them down like that so that is possible you can also just build foundation out if you wanted to um put in the water putting that and then yeah but um yeah but that is absolutely something that can be done i don't think you're supposed to be able to do that but you can so with that I could quite happily plug in down there the crystal and bring it along. It also works for power poles. Um, can't put a power pole on there, but if you have a power pole started and then you are building it via the cable, you can put them on there. It won't let me do it because it's encroaching someone else's clearance, but but um, but you can put them on there if we just remove that. And put them on there like that. It will completely let you do that. That's that's something that can be done. Uh, I don't quite know if you can get it so that it's 
them there. I don't think that's valid because I think the uh, no, that is that is also valid. That will work. Okay, so you could quite happily do it like that with the power poles next to it. You then you then can't obviously walk down it, but well, you know, beggars can't be choosers. Uh, I also believe yes, yeah, that's something else you can do. You can put power poles on top of conveyor belts, uh, like so. And uh, yeah, that's, I'm pretty convinced this is a bug. It's not supposed to be that way in any way, shape, or form because that wouldn't work. Um, but but building the walkways is a way to do it. So um, the question is, how am I going to do this? Do I want to run a walkway all the way along? I mean, because what I could do, rather than use those walkways. Is I could quite happily use these ones. Oh. Then, boom. and then just do it the same here. And then that way we could have the power poles running down the middle because they can sit on. Oh, there they come. Floor is too steep. Okay. They can run down the middle, like so. You can have conveyor belts on either side, travelling along and along. So then you don't have to walk, you can just jump them and travel along. I think that's what I'm going to do. It is quite a large task to do, and it is a little awkward when it comes to doing upwards and downwards, because you can't obviously have one like it. So you got to do it in the centre. And I don't want to fall to my doom, either. So, I might build it straight down from like the offset. I just saw something over there. What was that? Do, 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 do. What is that over there? I don't know. Water? Which is, I don't think you can get there. I think that's uh, that's beyond the void. Okay. Uh, but yeah, I think I might just from the offset right here build down. Straight down. Um, till I'm about level with that there and then go across to that one there and then once I'm at that one there that level there that's probably about right for going that way to there and then also we can figure out a way to get up to that wreck there as well which uh, there's probably a jumping pattern to go around the whole thing or climbing thing we just build build up but yeah that that's what i'm gonna think i'm gonna do um we'll put in a now where was the other there's another one that wasn't too far away from this one if memory serves ah hold on yes there's two of them here that's what it was there's two of them here so two normal which the mark two miners will be 240 crystals which is going to be awesome um, I could just build something here to produce the um, whatever it is here. This one, two kilometers of that way, which means the map's a lot larger than I thought. And I forget, I do have the map. Yeah. Yes, yeah, so the map goes right up there. So there's Doom. That wreck is done. There's our base. We've got all this land here we can spend our base into, but yeah. Basically what I'm going to do is come along here and uh, through this here. That's really, that's actually doomed down there. That's actually death. So, yeah. I'm pursue distance. Ah, that's how far it actually appears before you get close to it. All right. Awesome. Players, beacons, space elevator and the hub. But I'm going to turn the space elevator off for my compass because I don't need it there. I don't need to know where the space elevator is. As long as I point towards the hub, that's where the space elevator is. So yeah, 
So yeah, I'm going to uh, build this here and build this along and uh, next episode we shall come back and uh, I will hopefully have a supply of crystals coming along here going through the arch because I really want to do that and then going off that way to there and uh, I don't need to fall down that hole there because that hole there is absolute certain doom so we won't do that hopefully and uh, I will see you next time so thank you very much for watching I hope you enjoyed this one I hope to see you again next time and until then as always have fun